going to get guys. Fuck, I'm already stuttering and messing up. <laughs> my name is Halton, also known as Candish. Welcome back to Fear. I just woke up from my nap, so let's just get started. This is a commentary for this session, it's not gonna be as great. Oh, groin shot. Oh, groin shot. I'm so sorry. You have two in your groin. Okay. <laughs> Unless I do something like that, then it would be interesting. Yeah, commentary for this level is this section. Not gonna be as great because I'm like, I just woke up literally from my nap. So, from the previous session. I'm doing most of these all in quick succession because this game is really short. I'm trying to finish this game as quick as possible as uh, LP to have so I can get started on my next few LPs which then I'm gonna probably I'm doing a, another short one well then why don't you tell me why do you keep echoing my voice I'll keep commentating back on Fettel's voice yeah I know who it is I played the first one before the first fear before. I have a vague idea of what all the support or the spots that it's supposed to kill me, but it's just like I'm trying to rush to the game, I forget all about it. Are you kicking me this whole time, you bitch? Uh, I guess I should. I can talk about why I chose Fear to do it my first, my first FPS LP. I chose Fear because it felt like a really old game that people overlook, and people kind of use it as like, oh, sh what parts are scary, what parts are not. And then I just kind of decided to just really do it because it's gonna be like a nest nest I'm really tired nice epi mini epitheater for yourself which corporation yeah as I was saying um, I think fear is gonna be a nice trilogy to do my uh, I was scratching my back and I just saw some guy run through okay Yeah, I'm just saying, okay, oh, can I even finish my sentence before I keep getting the start? Yeah, I was thinking Fear is going to be a nice trilogy to play, so it's going to be a nice little segue into Penumbra. 
because okay, that door went over for a minute, so that's why I went rest in case something happens. Stay out of my way. I was gonna go and segue into Penumbra or Amnesia at the same time, but then it's just There's like no music, no sound or anything. I don't know if uh, game is doing. It. Okay, okay, okay. I'm a film student. Let me tell you guys something. Sound is where it's all at. Like that. This guy's thrusting his hips in the air. Sound and sudden action moments are really what puts the scary motion in. That's something you learn as a film major in common sense. But I would tell you guys that. And that's what I was saying. I don't think I ever even finished it. Uh. Oh god, Ninja Man! Is he dead? So I was saying, yeah, the game like segues into like one of the more scary games I plan to do, and I will do a. F and I will do a face cam on those. Like y'all know, from judging from these little. <laughs> It's Chuck Cabrera. Of course, it's Chuck Cabrera. Think of a cat, Cabrera. It's Chuck Cabrera. I don't care. Give me a lot because these ninja men hurt. But yeah, I was also saying, it's gonna be a nice little segue into one of the more scarier titles I have in my backlog that I want to do and that my friends want me to do, that everyone wants to do. And I feel like there's gonna be a freaking little crazy bitch that's gonna crawl, it's gonna crawl out and eat my face. This is gonna be a really quick session, though, you guys. They involve terrorism. Let's go to Diego Rodriguez live on the scene. Thanks, Phil. We're being told that just before 5 p.m. today, gunfire was reported at the downtown headquarters of Armacamp Technology Corporation, a major defense contractor. <coughs> now, what followed is unclear at this point. U.S. Army helicopters were seen approaching the building, but we've heard no. Okay. Okay. I played the first one a little bit before, so, and I saw my friend played the rest, so I have a vague idea of where most of the, the supposed bots that frighten you are. I just made a complete circle. Yep.
I don't really have a slight clue of where to go. So I beg your forgiveness. That's a nice office you have there. for a little bit because I'm going to try to figure out where to go F nope okay. I do plan to do more higher graphics games later on in the future but that's an unknown point because I'm playing most of this on my laptop and my laptop's the decent gaming laptop that's like f three years ago already <laughs> And a lot has kept, came out ever since then, like the razor blade, which is, I'm just throwing stuff out there, or like the MSI's, whatever, and the digital storms, whatever's, and so forth. Digital storms, or main gear. Uh, I'm just like throwing stuff out here. There's nowhere else to go. Where the hell did I go? Oh, right. Up. I didn't see that. God, I spent like past five minutes just wandering around it's okay these are gonna drop Ninjaman. That sounds like a good screen name for an MMO that has like warriors and stuff. But I'm still going with my original name, Candy Dish. attention to a single word, but that would have been nice. That's it, really. Don't shoot! My name is Norton Mapes. I I'm an engineer. Shit, it's a civilian. Give him a comm link. Screw you. You gonna try to Hello? BS Who me. Who are you people? The good guys. Are you alright? Oh sure. I'm having a hell of a time. You said you're an engineer? <laughs> Can you help me get into the network? What am I, an IS lackey? Tell you what, you disable the local security system, and I'll see what I can do about the server. I can disable it remotely once I'm logged in. No, you can't. It's on a separate network. Uh, he told you. It's back that way. Why do you want us to bring down the security system anyway? Never mind why. You want my help? That's the price. I don't want your help. You're a fat lard. It's gonna die if I remember correctly. This is gonna open up and he's gonna activate turrets. Sorry if I spoiled anything. I should have said spoiler alert. 